after a smile, closely missing out on going to Eurovision, you said you would not come back. Why did you change your decision? Mm. First of all, it was big scandal because jury was corrupted in that time. And uh, then I decided actually try again because I think that Eurovision Song Contest, it's a big opportunity uh, to be heard uh, and to share my music and uh, to show the high level of Ukrainian music, first of all. And that's why I, I forgot about other hurts and try again. The Ukrainian national final was intense. The jury and the close competition. What advice would you give a friend who wants to take part in 2017? I wasn't agree with the uh, jury in that time. I, I wasn't going to show my um, final performance in this selection, Ukrainian selection, because I will prepare completely new performance for Stockholm. It wasn't final, no, mo no matter what they say, be yourself. What is your goal for Eurovision? Would Ukraine be ready to host it in case you win? Mm, yes, I think we are ready. Um, of course, you know that the last two years Ukraine was quite famous in European media uh, by war in East, by annexion, by revolution and, and so on. But I want to show, I want to show you Ukraine from other side, from musician side. There has been lots of positive reaction from fans and media. Have you had any negative reactions? How will you respond to any critics? Mm. I didn't pay attention on it. Uh, I think for any musicians it's really quite tough to accept some critics. I can accept uh, critics uh, from very close uh, circle. It's my mom, my producer, that's all. <laughs> that's all. You mentioned 1944 tells the story of your grandmother. How does it feel to bear your heart to millions of listeners? Um, yeah, it, it hurts every time when I see it. Um, but I hope that I can show you through this song all my souls, all my heart involved in this song, involved in this music. Ukrainian entries are known to sound quite different at Eurovision than their original version. Should we expect it for 1944 as well? Mm. I wouldn't change a thing in 1944. I love sound, I love lyrics. Maybe it's, it's quite arrogant, but I'm sure that it's good. How different is going to be your performance in Stockholm to the one we saw in the national final? We prepare a completely new performance, and uh, but we keep details in, stick, in secret. And uh, I prepare a new dress, um, even a few dresses. And uh, uh, Vogue Ukraine announced kind of competition between Ukrainian designers. Mm, and in the beginning of April, I hope uh, I'll see new dress for Eurovision. What one personal item is most important to you to bring to Stockholm? Mm, 
I prefer not to mm, not to not to have such things not to, to be depends on something um, or it's just a, just a thing you have to I, 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 I have to bring my brain and my calmness to Stockholm.